Hello everyone, welcome back. Um, today I have another custom ROM for Galaxy J7 2015R. The model that I'm using is the Galaxy J7 00H and the custom ROM it's called Fast ROM. Uh, don't ask me why this is the name. Uh, just like the name suggests, this is a faster version of the updated stock ROM. So now firstly let's complete the installation process uh, by going to the Google Drive link and all of that. After you have installed it, uh, send these files or the zip files to your SD card. And if you're facing any lock screen issues, just download this another zip file from the developers. I didn't face it, so yeah, this might depend on your installation process and everything, I believe so. Um, let's flash the ROM now, shall we? So I'm going to give an overview for these features that doesn't work and that works in this ROM. So firstly here are a few things that doesn't work in this ROM which includes night clock, adaptive display or adaptive display. Screen saver uh, because it doesn't have any clock or like the like the stock application which is the clock doesn't work over here so I would say that doesn't work other than some other than the application of Google Photos that's what I've seen. The one-handed operations it doesn't function when you click three times like the button it just goes to camera when you select the quick camera option and all that so this is another useless feature here. And this smart capture part where like you, you wave your hand, it doesn't work over here. Uh, but however, like uh, here are a few perks that works which includes the editing the screenshots which is the smart capture over here. Uh, it also includes edge screen. Floating messages, floating windows, which is the multi window, and all of those. As well as this ROM, how much I have seen has a better battery life, uh, but I feel like the charging speed has decreased for some reason I feel like that or maybe it's just my device uh, but I still want you guys uh, if you if your battery life has been increased or if you have faced any issues just let me know in the comments below device maintenance is another advantage I feel like that this application does a lot of um, it's like there are a lot of options that you can choose or there are a lot of features that you can use in this application so yeah this is another feature 
Next up we have finally the app lock. Um, this is just based on if you want to use a lock then you should have a pattern instead of swipe. So yeah. So yeah, that's it for this video. Uh, I hope you guys uh, enjoyed the way I showed this video. I tried a new different style from all of my other videos and uh, this video won't get a review like all of my other um, custom ROMs but I have used this uh, custom ROM for about 4 days uh, to be honest and uh, this is the best custom ROM I have used up to now I would say. Uh, I will be dropping soon another video about the top 10 or like top 3 or 4 whichever custom ROMs I find like there will be some numerical or whatever uh, the top something numbers uh, of custom ROM that are best for Galaxy G7 in 2019 which will be released within the next day or maybe after a while of this video I'm not sure about that but yeah I'll be dropping that and yeah by that I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you do please drop a like and subscribe to the channel it helps me a lot um, we are very close to 50 subscribers and uh, I hope you guys subscribe so that I can get to the milestone and so thank you so much for watching this video I hope you got to learn how to download the custom ROM I hope each and every features has been included but if you still have any questions left please drop them in the comments below I will I'm free and I'm ready to listen to your feedback and I'm ready to reply so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time till then take care and bye.